In Wales, from the 1st of December 2015, the way we choose to be organ donors will change. It's time to make a choice about organ donation. This video explains the changes to the law and your choices. What is organ donation? When we die, we might be able to give some of our organs to someone else. A lot of people in Wales are waiting for new organs because their own have stopped working properly. Organs that have been donated could be given to these people. This is called an organ transplant. Every year, in Wales and across the UK, people die whilst waiting for an organ transplant. It is up to you to decide if you want to be an organ donor after you die. Whatever you decide, it is important to tell your family and friends. What is changing and when? From the 1st of December 2015, the way we choose to be donors in Wales will change. The new system is called a soft opt-out system. Soft opt-out means that if you want to be an organ donor, then you don't have to do anything. Unless you make a decision not to be a donor, you'll be treated as if you want to be one. This is known as deemed consent. This is different from the current system, which relies on people joining the NHS Organ Donor Register or their families making the decision. Why do we need a soft opt-out system for organ donation? There is a big shortage of organs for transplants in Wales and across the UK. One reason for the shortage is only a few people die in a way that means they could become organ donors. This is usually in hospital intensive care units or emergency departments. Another reason is when they are asked, many families say no to organ donation as they're not sure if their relative wanted to donate. Nine out of ten people in Wales agree with organ donation. But only three out of ten people have signed the NHS Organ Donor Register. The new system will be clearer for everyone. If family members are approached about organ donation, they will know their loved one could have opted out, but chose not to. We believe this could help increase the number of donors in Wales by 25%. What are my choices? I want to be an organ donor. You can register a decision to be an organ donor. Do nothing. You have no objection to becoming an organ donor. 
I don't want to be an organ donor. You can register a decision not to be an organ donor. What is an appointed representative? Most people will want to make their own decision about organ donation. But you can ask someone else, such as a religious leader, to make the decision for you. This is called appointing a representative. If it became possible for you to donate, your representative would be asked if your organs should be donated. If they cannot be contacted in time, then your family will be asked to make the decision. Want more information? Go to organdonationwales.org or call 0300 123 2323 facebook.com forward slash organ donation wales twitter.com forward slash org donation cym If you need any additional information or support, please contact Wales Council for Deaf People. Voice 01443 485 687 Text 01443 485 686 Email mail at wcdef.org.uk Who does the soft opt-out system apply to? The soft opt-out system will apply to people who are over the age of 18 and have lived in Wales for over 12 months and die in Wales and haven't registered a decision on the NHS Organ Donor Register. The soft opt-out will not apply to people who die outside Wales even if they normally live in Wales children and young people under the age of 18. People who have lived in Wales for less than 12 months. People who have registered an opt-in decision or an opt-out decision on the NHS Organ Donor Register. People who have appointed a representative to make a decision about organ donation. Visitors to Wales. Serving regular military personnel. Prisoners. People who may lack mental capacity to make a decision. People whose family can show they did not want to be a donor. What about children and young people? The soft opt-out system will not apply to people under 18. But children and young people can register a decision either to be a donor, opt-in, or not to be a donor, opt-out. Are families involved in a soft opt-out system? Yes. If it became possible for you to donate, your family or friends would always be involved. This is why the system is called a soft opt-out.
Families need to answer important questions about your medical history and if you normally lived in Wales. If they knew you did not want to be a donor, they would be able to say so. If family members or appointed representatives cannot be contacted, donation would not go ahead. Want more information? Go to organdonationwales.org or call 0300 123 2323. Facebook.com forward slash Organ Donation Wales. Twitter.com forward slash Org Donation CYM. If you need any additional information or support, please contact Wales Council for Deaf People. Voice 01443 485 687. Text 01443 485 686. Email mail at wcdef.org.uk. I want to be a donor. What can I do? To be a donor in Wales, you don't have to register. You can just do nothing and you will be treated as having no objection. But you can still register a decision to be a donor. Opt in. If you register as a donor, your decision will be available for NHS staff to see if you die somewhere else in the UK. By registering your decision, you can also choose which organs and tissues to donate. Want more information? Go to organdonationwales.org or call 0300 123 2323. Facebook.com forward slash Organ Donation Wales. Twitter.com forward slash Org Donation CYM. If you need any additional information or support, please contact Wales Council for Deaf People. Voice 01443 485 687. Text 01443 485 686. Email mail at wcdeaf.org.uk. I don't want to be a donor and I'd like to record my decision. What should I do? You can register a decision not to be a donor, opt out at any time. By going online or calling 0300 123 2323. Opt-out decisions will take effect from the 1st of December 2015. Between now and then, your registered decision will be available to NHS staff to discuss with your family if organ donation was possible. You can change your mind at any time. To register your organ donation decision, go to organdonationwales.org or call 0300 123 
2323. If you need any additional information or support, please contact Wales Council for Deaf People. Voice 01443 485 687. Text 01443 485 686. Email mail at wcdef.org.uk. You can change your registered decision at any time. Make sure you also tell your family and friends. What if I'm already on the NHS Organ Donor Register? If you are already on the register, then you still have the same choices as everyone else. You can decide to stay on the NHS Organ Donor Register. This will be treated as a decision to be a donor, opt-in, from the 1st of December 2015. Remove your record from the NHS Organ Donor Register. From the 1st of December, you'll be treated as having no objection to organ donation. Removing your name from the register is not the same as opting out. Register a decision not to be an organ donor. Opt out. This will change your existing decision from wanting to be a donor to not wanting to be a donor. Want more information? Go to organdonationwales.org or call 0300 123 2323. Facebook.com forward slash Organ Donation Wales Twitter.com forward slash org donation CYM If you need any additional information or support, please contact Wales Council for Deaf People. Voice 01443 485 687 Text 01443 485 686 Email mail at wcdef.org.uk Am I already on the NHS Organ Donor Register? You can check by calling 0300 123 2323. Frequently Asked Questions If organ donation is possible, what happens? Organ donation is rare and does not affect the care and treatment a person is given. Doctors decide if a patient is a suitable donor. Only then is their family approached and organ donation discussed. Once the person is confirmed to have died, then organ donation can proceed. Most organ donors are patients who die as a result of a brain hemorrhage, severe head injury or stroke. Some patients who die in other ways may also be able to donate certain organs. What happens to organs donated in Wales? There is one UK system for matching donated organs with patients needing a transplant.
This means that organs donated in Wales might be used in transplants across the UK. In the same way, organs from other parts of the UK are transplanted into Welsh residents. This is the fairest way of ensuring the people who need the organs most get them. If more organs are donated, there is a better chance of a person receiving a suitable organ wherever they live in the UK. Want more information? Go to organdonationwales.org or call 0300 123 2323 facebook.com forward slash organ donation wales twitter.com forward slash org donation cym If you need any additional information or support, please contact Wales Council for Deaf People. Voice 01443 485 687 Text 01443 485 686 Email mail at wcdef.org.uk